Hey guys, what's up? It's Charlie here and today we're going to be looking at 10 photos that will restore your faith in humanity. If you turn on the news or even just look outside, the world can sometimes seem like a pretty rough place. But these pictures will hopefully brighten your day and give you a better outlook on the world you live in. So be sure to leave a like on the video and subscribe and comment I subscribed and I'll try to reply. So, coming in at number 10, we have Saving Dog. A lot of us have a soft spot for dogs and other animals, which is why it's always a tragedy when one is hurt or put in danger. In 2014, a woman called Sue Drummond was walking her Shih Tzu dog named Bibby in Melbourne, Australia. Bibby was small and weak, but the wind was not, and Bibby ended up being blown into the rough waters of the Melbourne pier that Sue had been walking her on. Many onlookers watched, but nobody stopped and helped, and Sue thought that Bibby was done for, until a passerby named Raden, who was scattering his grandmother's ass into the waters saw the dog. He quickly stripped down to his underwear and saved Bibi's life. While no one else helped, Raden saved the day with an act that I'm sure would make his grandmother very proud. Next up we have Sacrificial Athlete. Athletes train all year round for that end goal. A big win. But in this image, one runner proved that there's more to being a great athlete than just winning. Megan Vogel and Arden McMath had been running rivals at their school before the race. On the day, the race began and Arden was in first place, with Megan in second. When suddenly, Arden's leg gave out and she fell. Every other runner ran right by, using her fall as an opportunity to get ahead. However, Megan stopped, despite the fact that she likely would have won if she had kept going. She helped Arden up and wrapped her arm around her shoulders before slowly running to the finish line with Arden so that both girls could complete the race. While Megan did make a sacrifice, she didn't exactly lose out, as a professional running team saw this act of good sportsmanship and offered her a place on the team. Next up we have Shoes for Homeless. When you think of Rio de Janeiro in Brazil, amazing scenery, the Olympics and lavish beaches come to mind. But the darker side of Rio that they don't want you to see involves mass poverty. One American tourist was exploring Rio when he found himself in a poor area. And in that area was a young homeless girl sporting tatty clothing and no shoes. While the tourist didn't have any money or food about him, he gave up something simple but essential, his shoes. The man handed his flip flops over to the homeless girl so that she wouldn't have to hurt her feet walking on the hot sand. It may be a small sacrifice for the man, but it's a huge help for the girl. Next up we have Kitten Carrier. In Kutak City, India, floods are frequent, and they can damage homes, businesses, and even injure people. In a time of great crisis like this, it can be easy to flee and save yourself and forget everyone else. But one hero waded through dangerous water to rescue these kittens that were recently born in the area. They were found clinging to a tree branch about to be washed away by the choppy waters. While most people were only thinking about themselves, this man decided to save the day by saving these kittens' lives. The photo really shows that no matter how bad things get, helping others is always a noble thing to do. Next up we have Triathlon Hero. A lot of fathers and daughters do bonding activities together. However, this can sometimes prove difficult if your daughter has a condition like cerebral palsy. Cerebral palsy restricts your movements and causes your muscles to be too weak to move. This man named Rick Van Beek runs a local triathlon with his 14-year-old daughter Maddie every year. He pulls her in a kayak during the swimming part, pushes her in a cart during the cycling part, and pushes her wheelchair for the running parts. Rick shows that even though his daughter has a life-changing condition, she can still bond with her dad just like any other girl. And he says that while while he is Maddie's legs, she is his heart. Next up, we have a flower for a soldier. Today, there are many conflicts all around the world. Soldiers often get a bad rep from citizens of countries they're in because of the results of warfare that can sometimes occur. However, this amazing image shows an American soldier being given a flower by an Afghan girl. Even though some people in the two countries may have differences, this is one act of compassion caught on camera. The image is also an example of the innocence and good nature of children that is bound to make you smile. Even the soldier looks pretty blown away by this amazing act of kindness. Next up we have free books. With ebooks and the rise of digital media, bookstores are a declining business. However, one awesome bookstore left out this sign. The sign says that if someone comes to the store with no money and they want to read a book, then they can go ahead and help themselves. Even though the bookstore is probably going through hard times too, they still accommodate for those with little or no money to enjoy reading. The store's owner says reading is something that everyone should be able to enjoy, and this could even help students or unemployed people to learn. It's safe to say that this is one amazing act of kindness. 
Next up, we have free subs. We usually don't associate big businesses with being kind to those in need. However, one subway store in Los Angeles displays this sign every Friday. The sign says that all homeless people in the area are to be given a free meal. This really shows that not all businesses are ruthless and sometimes want to make a real difference. While many people buy a subway sandwich every day as a typical lunch, to some it's a rarity to have a meal, let alone a whole subway sandwich. Whatever subway worker came up with this idea definitely deserves a raise. Next up we have sheep savers. We've seen people rescuing animals such as dogs and cats, but what about sheep? In 2012, two men named Eric Bjornoy and Torvald Ask were walking near the sea in Norway. They saw what they thought was a white ball in the water and went to get it. However, once they got a bit closer, they were shocked to find a sheep in the waters. Eric considered jumping into the waters to rescue it, but this would end up with Eric and the sheep both facing the punishment of the waters. So instead, a dramatic rescue mission took place. Torvald lowered Eric into the water as he stretched across to pull the sheep ashore. After 20 to 30 minutes of trying, they finally rescued the sheep. Not only do these photos show the power of teamwork, but also the rescue of a very cute animal. Next up we have free dry cleaning. Times are tough for a lot of people right now, and unemployment is on the rise in many parts of the world. This isn't exactly a very happy fact, but this photo is proof that some people can make anything positive, no matter how bad the situation. This dry cleaners called Plaza Cleaners in Portland, Oregon displayed this sign in their window. It says that if you're unemployed and need a suit cleaned for a job interview, they'll clean it for free. Plaza Cleaners have helped over 4,000 unemployed people to be able to afford dry cleaning and make their chances of landing a job increase dramatically. And it's estimated that it's cost them over $60,000. I hope this incredible act of kindness has boosted their business business in return. And that just about wraps up this video. Check out the poll in the top right corner and you guys can vote for the most touching photo. But as always, thanks for watching, check out some more videos on screen right now, leave a like if you enjoyed and if you haven't already, what are you waiting for? Subscribe!